This is Feed Your Mind, and so I came across some very interesting video footage that might help explain what stars are. And also, this footage might also explain and prove that there are actually waters above. And so when we're looking above and we see the stars and the so-called planets and stuff, there, that might exist in a water-based area above the earth the bible informed us that in the beginning the waters below were separated from the waters above and i went into detail about this before about how that could explain what people think gravity is there could be some type of resistance possibly a magnetic type frequency as well that are keeping the waters above up there because it would be repelling from the waters below just like how a magnet if it's north and south uh, poles are um they can they can um resist each other and then if you have the other the opposite of a magnet uh with the south and north poles they'll be attracted to each other so it almost appears that it's possible that the waters above are repelling from the waters below and that could create some type of a uh, uh, resistance and it's even possible that there could be much more to that is there a medium in between possibly that scientists could be possibly using as orbit um we'll have to get more into those possibilities in another video because in this video, we're going to really explain what's going on with this water that created a star in a science lab. And so the scientists have this jar of liquid. It looks like distilled water, most likely. Um, they don't really say what type of liquid this is, but when they release a sonar, type of a frequency into the water they're not telling us what type of frequency they ha had to um use but this frequency of sound waves triggered a bubble to first it expanded and then it collapsed into a bluish light that looks exactly like a star so this also helps explain how the Bible says God spoke everything into existence using words and stuff. So now we see the effect that sound can have on a bubble to create this star. It looks like a bluish slash purplish star. It looks just like a star sitting in the middle of this uh, container of water. Well, what looks like water. Um, and then so the scientists have discovered this um, technology, if you will, whatever you want to call it. It's a repeatable, observable experiment where we can see how stars could possibly exist in a watery medium and also how this explains with the sound the sound waves so with the universe universe means one verse so it almost suggests that there's secrets to why they chose that word because a verse is full of sounds and so we're not going to really get into the multiverses the, well the possibility of multiverses um, in this video but that's what we'll save that for another time but as far as the universe that suggests a song a verse is a song and so we see that there's the description of a song being um, saying that could create the 
physical world that we see and with this evidence. So look, I'm going to leave a link so you can check out this scientific experiment for yourself. They're calling this scientific experiment sonoluminance. So it's a um, sonar type uh, technology and the luminous of making this bubble turn into an energy um, that is visible to anyone looking into the jar. You would see just the strangest thing when you see the star in the middle of a jar that was made out of a bubble using sound waves. So check out the footage. Let me know what you think. Um, I'm going to leave the link, like I said, in the comment section in the description box. They're saying this sound, well, this star is possibly tens of thousands of degrees of heat. Um, scientists are saying that basically it's a reaction from the sound that was introduced into the water. And we discussed how uh, water responds to sound. Like, there's all types of experiments where scientists have had crystals and or water crystals and uh, they've been able to study how sound and words can affect water molecules in response to them which could make you question uh, physical reality just by doing these experiments and this is all stuff for another video where we can get into that where it's like our physical reality is much more than what we've been told because how is sound and water, how is sound manipulating water to form different types of uh, shapes of, of crystals? The hateful words could lead to the water being um, real ugly shaped. And then like the um, loving words and stuff can make the water crystals form beautiful water crystals. And so sound and um, energy affects water crystals in it. There's um, also studies that could suggest that um, matter can be affected outside of just water. So all of these clues seem to be related to this whole thing with the um, with the star being able to, well, this the science lab being able to generate a star out of water out of a water bubble. This is um, pretty groundbreaking footage. It also could leave uh, could lead to clues about power and energy itself. If sound and water can create this energy, I mean, why are we still stuck and stuck on what they call fossil fuels and oil? If they have all these technologies, I did another video on my feature mine three channel where we covered how there was another experiment with water where they were able to power devices using water so we're gonna have to get all those videos documented and put on this channel officially um so if uh if you can support this channel i'd appreciate it because we're gonna have to, i'm gonna have to redo these videos and put them out as documentary style videos if we can get a chance we just need much more support it's just I'm just asking for a dollar because most people wouldn't even notice that, but it would help my channel so I can put these important videos out the correct way. So I can put the video footage in the video and put all types of pictures and um, visuals to assist in explaining the data uh, that I'm presenting. So your support will help me get those videos out. We're way we're, we're, we need um, we need we need some support to help get these videos out because it takes time to put those videos out correctly. So if, if you can, I'd appreciate it. Uh, link will be in the comment section in the description box. But let me know your thoughts about everything when you check out this video um, of this science experiment. Come back here and, and let me know what you think about everything so we can build on the information. Um, I'm also going to leave a link for my email newsletters. You can sign up to my free email newsletters. Uh, I'm also going to leave links to my social media. Plus, I'm going to be at my Feed Your Mind 3 channel dropping 
videos on subjects I don't cover on this channel. So all links will be in the comment section in the description box. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. This has been Feed Your Mind, signing off.